lucky to find any normal resources here. But centuries of asteroid impacts have scattered mineral fragments and crystallized Vespine all over the wreck. All right, we'll scout around and see what we can pick up. Go ahead. SCV ready. Add-on complete. Add-on complete. Add-on complete. SCV ready. Move it! SCV ready. Patching you through. You hail? What is it? Huh? It's your dime. SCB ready. Additional supply depots required. Course laid in. Mineral field depleted. Course laid in. 
All right, boys. Hit him with the Yamato can. A couple of shots from that'll flatten any. Additional mineral supplies have been located nearby. Mineral field depleted. mothership is formidable, sir. Scans indicate it's capable of cloaking nearby friends and phasing enemies out of existence for a short time.
Ah, you scared me! Big job. Yeah. We will join the hunt for the Taldarim. Whatever that means. I bask in the twilight. I will comply. Ah, don't get your knickers in a bunch. The darkness rides. I am but a fear is an illusion. By the void, I am intrigued. Move it, move it, come on. Go ahead. Roger. What's going on? I'm going. Yeah. Huh? Ah! You scared me! In the rear with the gear. Big job, huh? Will do! Go ahead! Insufficient Vespine gas. Ah, don't get your knickers in a bunch. Huh? You're the boss. This better be good. We hear you. Additional supply depots required. Bad news. Gangway. Coming Vespine Geyser exhausted. Bad news.
Not enough minerals. Add-on complete. The doctor is in. Mineral field depleted. in the fleet. Not enough minerals. Yo! 
Vespine Geyser exhausted. Vespine Geyser exhausted. Ben, what's going on? Upgrade complete. By the void, I am but a phantom. I am intrigued. Darkness descends. Battle is upon us. By the void. We could use some help here. Okay. Give me orders. 
Chambers. We'll do. Upgrade complete. Move it, move it, come on. Okay. What's going on? Big job, huh? Nuclear missile ready. Whatever that means. Upgrade complete. set a course to rendezvous with Valerian.
Now you boys gotta wake up. Rainer sold us out. I joined this outfit to fight the Dominion, not work for him. Everybody simmer down. We trusted the commander before. We should trust him now. You can't trust that drunk. Jim Rayner's nothing but a spineless coward. You've been nothing but poison since you got on this crate. That right. Not pathetic. Only person you can trust is yourself. The sooner you peons figure that Heard out. Heard about enough of this. Jimmy. But the first sign of trouble, you'll just duck and run. It's what you do, ain't it? Me, them, that pretty little girlfriend of yours. Something you're gonna regret, Tigus. Got us working for the Dominion now, Commander. Taking us back to Char. It's like you're gone already. This ain't about the Dominion. Our war has always been about saving lives. If the Zerg wipe everyone out, it's all been for nothing. So I'm going back to Char. If you're with me, it's your choice. Just like it's always been. Now that's the commander I've been waiting on. Satisfied? <laughs> Let's get back to work, boys. I don't want to have to have this conversation again. And fix my damn jukebox. Well, Junior, we got our hands on the final artifact. You can take possession of the whole set at any time. Thank you, Commander, and well done. You're every bit as resourceful as I've been led to believe. I think the odds are stacking in our favor. You better hope so. Delivering this artifact thing right to Kerrigan's doorstep, we're gonna need all the luck we can get. Rest easy. We'll have the might of the Dominion fleet behind us. Right. 
You still got a problem with us working alongside Valerian? <sighs> Max turned out to be a ruthless dictator, but that shouldn't automatically condemn his son. I followed you through hell and back, sir. I'm not quitting on you now. Good man. This truce won't last forever. Just long enough to get the job done. On a personal note, nice job with Tychus. That ass kicking's been a long time coming. She is my man. How can I be helping you, Mr. Reyna? You sit up here watching everything. Tell me what you see. Tyke is just a mean drunk. I wish it was just that. All that jealousy and rage. He's fighting himself over something he don't want to do. You'll see. May as well get me another round. Hell, maybe even two. You came to the right place. This is Donnie Vermillion, live from UNN Studios on Core Hall. Troubling news tonight, as Crown Prince Valerian seems to have gone missing. That's right, Donnie. Prince Valerian was scheduled to speak at the launch of the Dominion's newest battlecruiser, the White Star. But the ceremony had to proceed without the Prince when he failed to arrive. Official government sources offered no comment. Whatever the situation, we here at UNN hope the Prince is okay. Oh, Junior's doing just fine. So far. You ready to tell me what the hell that was all about? Man, these last few weeks, helping you fight the good fight, I've finally got a taste of what real freedom is. But that's all coming to an end with you charging off like some damn hero for a cause I couldn't care less about. And what was all that talk earlier about doing humanity a favor and getting paid well in the process? It just seems the closer we get to your Queen of Blades. Well, let's just say things don't always work out the way you plan, Jimmy. I need you with me on this one, Tigus. Trust me. For old time's sake. All right, all right, I'm with you. That's my boy. Old times. How you holding up down here, Chief? Better, now we got our old commander back. Oh, and our new best friend, Prince Charming, came through with some upgraded battlecruiser schematics. I've been working on some interesting modifications for our ships. I'll check them out. Where we're going, we're gonna need all the firepower we can get. Everything is in motion to begin the final act. The invasion of the primary Zerg Hive on Char. Once we begin, there will be no turning back. Ensure that you are fully prepared, Commander. Destiny awaits. Oceans of fire, 
tectonic storms, and an atmosphere that'll burn a man alive. But we've planned for all of that. You can't plan for the Zerg, General. They ain't gonna fit into your nice, clean timetable. I've led five separate invasions against the Swarm. I held the line while you and your terrorist friends hid under a rock. We're all aware of your victories, General. I've invited Commander Raynor here to assist us with any unforeseen contingencies. Well, it sounds like you got it all figured out, Junior. I have far too much invested in this undertaking to see it fail. Speaking of which, you might particularly enjoy this next step. Valeri! I've just received a report you've taken half the fleet. Care to explain yourself, boy? Father, I am about to accomplish that which you never could. Today, I will defeat the Queen of Blades and secure peace throughout the Dominion. By this act, the people will finally know that I am a worthy successor to you. I love your gumption, son, but you're in way over your head. What makes you think you have the experience to... She ain't alone, Arcturus. Reyna. I don't know what gutter my son fished you out of, but even you've got to realize that treacherous bitch cannot be saved. And neither can you. We'll see about that. And when this is over, you and me got a score to settle. Everything I could have hoped for. You're playing a dangerous game here, kid. Prince Valerian, we have Zerg attack waves incoming. Already? surface scattered all over the place. Do you think death is the worst thing that can happen to you here? Infestation is what's coming for you. Soon all will start the swarm. She's trying to get in our heads, man. We gotta keep it together. If we're gonna pull this caper off, we need to rally as many survivors as we can. Commander. Dominion battle groups are still landing all around you, but they're in pretty bad shape and coming under heavy attack from the Zerg. All right. Let's get out there and rescue their sorry butts. We need to pull together a real fighting force, but we won't have a prayer of stopping Kerrigan. <laughs> <laughs> 